Hello everybody, it's NoobTube back with another video for you. Could you be so kind as to hit that big red subscribe button on your lower right hand side, please? Just right below the screen since you probably haven't zoomed into the video. Thank you. Let's get into the video. But first... Ah, oh, what a beautiful sky. Oh look, the forest and coal. Ooh, mushrooms and sugar cane. Huh, what is this? This looks interesting. What does this do? It smells kind of weird. Well, hello again, guys. And now that that warning is over, man, that noob tube can be a real boge sometimes, am I right? But hey, a boge is right at least twice a day, and I know he was right at least that one time, so kids, stay away from cigarettes. Anyways, as you can see, I have a little camp here. I have a fire that serves little purpose whatsoever other than to look good. So let's go over here. Here's our tobacco. As you can see, you can just delete it like that. Although, I'm not in creative, but it looks like leaves, and you can replant it, you can get seeds, it grows just like any other plant. However, you may be noticing that I am, in fact, standing on the plants. Like, this is weird. It sounds like you're walking on a grass block. I have my hoe right here, I have my bed right here, my tent, my barrels full of all my goodies. So without further ado, let's look at what this mod actually has to offer. First off... We have our different leaves. I know how to do fire cured. I have no idea how to do air cured. We have our seeds right here, so you can actually plant the addictive plant in the garden. Then we have our hand-rolled cigarettes that are non-filtered. I don't know what the point of this is, but I'll show you how to light one up right here in a second. We have our dark-fired loose tobacco, our half zoar loose tobacco. Guys, I have no idea what that means because I don't use cigarettes, and I suggest you follow the same principle. I'm going to grab just a few of these cakes right here, and just a few right here. Yeah, I'm not going to sit here and do all that in front of you. We have our glass jar of tobacco. I believe you can actually smoke this stuff right here pretty easily. Here we have some pipe tobacco. We have our matchbox right here. The matchbox is very important if you want to light anything in this game. So we're going to definitely take that with us and we're going to take our pipe, which I'm going to replace because it's been used. And then we have our cigarettes. And you're probably thinking to yourself, oh my, that's a lot. Well, you haven't seen anything yet. Here are the rest of them. And we're going to grab Jingling. So you're going to click the cigarette since you have your matchbox. But first, let me show you what it's like without the matchbox. Click. I'm clicking and nothing. Now let me show you with the matchbox. Click. Since you're in creative mode, you're going to get one that appears right here. You're going to hold down. You're just going to click down, and then you're, you can hold it here for however long you want to, and then let go. You hold it down, and then let go. Right here, we have our jingling. So we're going to click the box. Just click. This has... 19 cigarettes in it now because I took one out holds 20 guys I don't know what the standard is because again. I don't smoke so I wouldn't know that information We're gonna get rid of this one since it's not important You're gonna come over here and just do the exact same thing and you'll occasionally get notes on the side of your screen Lower left hand side like you used a command and it's gonna say just any random message whenever it pops up I'll let you know but that is a nicotine pouch Better for you than smoking, but how about not get addicted to nicotine in the first place? That would also be a great idea. You're going to click your pipe. See, I can smoke it, but nothing happens. You can feel slight tingling under the lip. See right here? I just put tobacco into my pipe. And now, you can taste smoked meat. How is that a good taste? Okay, so you're going to hold it down like this and release. 
We're going to need this later for the cigars, which I'll show you in just a second. I'm going to get this one out because I did not feature it yet. Guys, I had to reshoot this video because my roommate decided that he would walk in. Okay. Okay, so we're going to click this. Narrow wall Savannah Pipe Club. Pipe. See? You're going to light it. Yeah, you can taste citrus notes. This has citrus in it, apparently. You can just click E, go to your inventory, and hover over it, and you can see everything. Smooth black Cavendish, nutty barley, and sweet Virginia are complemented by the essence of tangy cherries and softened with a warm, creamy note. My goodness, if you were to read the description of tobacco products, you would think it was a dessert or something, or like a ice cream, maybe, of sorts. Okay. I don't know how many puffs you can get out of this. How many licks does it take to get to the center of a Tootsie Pop? Mr. Owl, how many licks does it take to get to the Tootsie Roll center of a Tootsie Pop? Let's find out. One, two, three, three. Discard this wretched yet beautiful smelling thing. Yeah, guys, if you've ever smelled pipe smoke, it actually smells good. We're going to get our Romeo and Juliet box. Here we go. It's going to work the same way, but I'm going to show you something very specific. Okay, here we go. I don't believe I can light this up. Yeah, I can't light it up. You know why I can't light it up? Because I have to have a cigar cutter. Guys, I didn't know that was a thing, but I guess if you think about it, the end of the cigars are rolled up. So you're going to click, and then you're going to discard. Then you're going to click. And then you're going to discard what you just clicked. And you can keep this on you, I guess. Here is your cigar. As you can see, the end of it right there, if I put it into the light a little bit, you can see that there is a little bit of gray signifying that it is lit. It does not, it does not have smoke coming out of it like it is lit until you actually puff it. Fun fact, guys, cigar smoke, you don't actually inhale it. You just kind of taste it. You can taste earthy notes. Guys, I swear they just send random messages, but yeah. Um, if you want to get some stuff here, you can deposit. Guys, I still haven't been able to figure out how you deposit stuff here or what you deposit. It may be emeralds. I'll check just for you guys because I love each and every one of you. If, I'm going to see if this does anything. Nope. Oh, guys, the, the leaves cannot be put into the compost bin. Just BTW right there. You have a glass jar right here, and you have your cake right here, and I'm gonna get this. I think you may just be able to put it in here, like so. Yes! So, guys, in order to fill this glass jar with your dark barley tobacco cake, oh, and look, you've unlocked a new recipe. You actually get a notification saying that you learned how to do something. And I can just sit here and just click, 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 click. I'm in creative mode, so this stuff isn't running out like it should. I don't know if this runs out, but I'm sure there's a limited amount that you can put into your pipe, and then it's gone after that. Guys, I don't think you can craft the pipe. Guys, if you're going to smoke in this game, you're going to have to do it in creative and get it. But on the bright side, you can make a very realistic gas station. Like, I, I don't in any ways endorse smoking, and I'm going to continue to say that in this video, because I don't want people thinking I do. I just thought this would be a fun video to do. It's kind of funny, to be honest, and interesting. People are always looking for more mods and stuff, and that's what I wanted to do. I just wanted to explore some mods, because I like mods a lot. Mods really do make Minecraft, apart from the playing with your friends and whole survival aspect, you know stuff like that which this would actually be a pretty good world for surviving i spawned right over there right behind me and i have more than enough trees and stuff in order to be pretty prosperous i even have ice over there but of course i decided to i don't know tarnish the world by adding tobacco in it like with mods and stuff you can change the game and your whole experience so if you are over the age of I don't know, what's a responsible age? 16, maybe? I don't know, I know a lot of stupid 16 year olds. If you think that you're responsible and that your parents won't care, feel free to download this mod and play around with it. Of course, don't do any of this in real life. Um, if you're going to be a farmer, there are tons of other things to plant other than tobacco. Guys, thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. Um, 
If you did not like the content therein, then read next time you click on a video. Goodbye. Thank you so much for watching. Have a blessed rest of your day.